Brooks Nader, a prominent model known for her striking presence in the fashion world, and Gleb Savchenko, a celebrated professional dancer from Dancing with the Stars have recently become the subject of romance speculation. Nader, who is 27 years old, took to her social media platforms to share a photo that has set tongues wagging. In the image she is seen seated on Savchenko's lap, with both of them resting their hands on each other's thighs in what appears to be a relaxed and intimate pose. The photo quickly drew attention from fans and followers, fueling speculation about the nature of their relationship. Savchenko, a veteran of the dance competition who has earned a reputation for his incredible skill and charisma on the dance floor, has addressed the rumors surrounding his relationship with Nader. He expressed that he thinks Nader is great and acknowledged the amazing chemistry they share. Despite these positive sentiments, Savchenko has clarified that their relationship has not yet progressed to a romantic level. This statement has done little to quell the buzz among fans, who are eagerly awaiting the start of the 33rd season of Dancing with the Stars where they will be able to witness Nader and Savchenko's dynamic up close. Dancing with the Stars is no stranger to the development of romantic relationships among its participants. The show's unique format, which involves intense rehearsals and high-pressure performances, often serves as a breeding ground for close connections. The shared experience of competing in such a high-stakes environment creates opportunities for deep bonds to form. This phenomenon is not new. The show has a history of fostering relationships that sometimes extend beyond the competition. Rachel Goldberg, a licensed marriage and family therapist based in Studio City, California, offers insights into why such connections often occur on the show. Goldberg explains that the nature of the competition where participants are united by a common goal of winning and excelling creates an initial bond between partners. This bond is further strengthened by the physical closeness required for dancing, which involves constant touch and shared space. These physical interactions can trigger physiological responses that enhance attraction making romantic feelings more likely to develop. Goldberg also highlights the role of the high-pressure environment in fostering these connections. The emotional roller coaster of the competition, with its highs and lows, provides a context in which participants form deep bonds. The dance floor becomes a space where the only person who fully understands and shares the experience with a participant is their partner. The shared experiences of success and disappointment contribute to a strong emotional connection. Moreover, the personalities of the participants, who are often media-savvy and attractive, further enhance the allure of these relationships. The show's history is filled with notable examples of relationships that have blossomed from the competition. For instance, season 25 of Dancing with the Stars in 2017 saw Nikki Bella and Artem Chigvintsev meet and eventually develop a romantic relationship. Their connection, which began during the show, evolved into a serious relationship, culminating in Chigvintsev's proposal to Bella in January 2020. The couple married in 2022 and have a four-year-old son, Mateo. However, their relationship recently encountered significant challenges. Chigvintsev was arrested on August 29th following a report of domestic violence. After being booked and released on bail, Bella filed for divorce on September 11th, seeking sole custody of their son. Another notable connection is between Matthew Lawrence and Cheryl Burke. Although Lawrence never competed on Dancing with the Stars himself, his connection to the show is significant. His brother, Joey Lawrence, competed in season three, which led to Matthew meeting Burke. They began dating in February 2007, but their initial romance ended after a year. They rekindled their relationship in 2017 and married in 2019. However, Burke filed for divorce in 2022, citing irreconcilable differences. The dynamics between professional dancers and their celebrity partners are not always straightforward. Derek Huff and Brooke Burke, for instance, never dated, but Burke has openly expressed her admiration for Huff. On Cheryl Burke's podcast, Sex, Lies, and Spray Tans, Burke admitted that had she been single, she would have pursued a romantic relationship with Huff. She described the intense connection formed through their dance partnership as being more intimate than typical romantic encounters. The show has also seen brief romances, such as that between Alexis Wren and Alan Burstyn. Their relationship, which began during the 27th season, was documented on the show. Wren admitted to developing feelings for Burstyn, but their relationship ended shortly after the season due to their respective commitments and travel schedules. Karina Smirnoff and Mario Lopez, another pair from the show's third season, enjoyed a two-year relationship before splitting in 2008 amid rumors of Lopez's infidelity. Despite the end of their relationship, their time together remains a memorable part of the show's history. Finally, Robert Herjavec and Kim Johnson met during the 20th season of Dancing with the Stars in 2015. Their connection led to marriage in 2016 and the birth of twins, Hudson and Haven, in 2018.
Johnson retired from the show after the 2017 season, but Herjavec's and Johnson's relationship remains one of the show's success stories. The allure of Dancing with the Stars extends far beyond the dazzling performances and competitive spirit. The close-knit environment and intense interactions often lead to the formation of romantic relationships, adding an intriguing layer to the show's appeal. Whether these relationships stand the test of time or become fleeting moments in the show's history, they contribute to the ongoing fascination with the world of dance and romance.